Welcome back to 504 Road Trips. Today we continue our drive south on US 61 in Adams County, Mississippi, beginning at around mile 40 as we leave the city of Natchez. We're going all the way to the Louisiana border in this video, covering that last 40 miles. We pass through the unincorporated community of Sibley. The St. Catherine Creek National Wildlife Refuge is just to the west of the town. A post office operates in Sibley with a zip code of 39165.
We enter Wilkinson County, named for James Wilkinson, a Revolutionary War military leader and the first governor of the Louisiana Territory after its acquisition by the United States in 1803. Wilkinson County's major commodity crop is cotton, although a bull weevil infestation destroyed nearly the entire crop in the early 20th century. After the Civil War, sharecropping arrangements were made with the now free African American farm workers. Although they make up a majority of the population of the county, violence against African Americans was prevalent throughout the era of the Civil Rights Movement. The population of the county has declined due to a lack of jobs, mostly caused by mechanization of the farming industry. Today, Wilkinson County has a population of 8,792, down from a peak of 21,453 in 1900.
we enter the city of Woodville, the county seat of Wilkinson County, with a population of 928 as of the 2020 census. The town is one of the oldest in Mississippi, incorporated in 1811 after the Louisiana Purchase of 1803 and prior to the admission of Mississippi into the Union in 1817. Painter John James Audubon visited Woodville during his sojourn in St. Francisville in the 1820s. Here he found more than 26 of the species which he documented and painted for his Birds of America series. Prior to the 1960s, the road we're on did not exist, and US 61 took a different path on what is now State Highway 24, which runs right through the center of town. The highway made a left turn on the western edge of town and headed south, a route which will rejoin just after leaving the town limits. The community has organized the Woodville Main Street Association. Among the association's initiatives are the Woodville Hospitality Station providing tourist information and a rest stop to travelers on Highway 61 near the town boundary. The annual Deer and Wildlife Festival is staged each October on and around the Courthouse Square. Woodville's town plan is centered on the Courthouse Square planted with ancient oaks. The turn of the 20th century Beaux-Arts style courthouse has a spire. More than 100 buildings contribute to Woodville's National Register Historic District. They include structures from the first quarter of the 19th century, with examples of Federal, Eastlake, Arts and Crafts, Greek Revival, Beaux-Arts, and Neoclassical Architecture. Fronting Courthouse Square are the monumental office and banking house of the West Feliciana Railroad circa 1834. The former railroad office now serves as the Wilkinson County Museum. The classic federal-style former branch banking house of the state of Mississippi, circa 1819, the state's oldest existing bank building, has been adapted to serve as the African American Museum.
We conclude today's video as we enter the state of Louisiana, the final state in our long journey. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, please give us a thumbs up, post a comment, subscribe, share and follow us on social media, and join us for our next 504 road trip.